It's not only the students that need to learn. Physics teachers from across the Bathurst diocese have held their first intensive training session, looking at the new syllabus for years 11 and 12. The new syllabus was announced about three weeks ago, but these guys can't wait to get into it. With the new content, there's a whole load of new experiments that will need to happen. So we've been um, going through a whole load of new experiments with equipment. It's uh, quite interesting. Schools will probably have to buy a lot of new equipment. For some teachers, it will be going back to the previous syllabus prior to 2001, while for newer teachers, it will be learning a new way of teaching the subject. One of the biggest changes is there's a lot more mathematics in the new syllabus. So there's twice as many experiments that students are going to have to use and manipulate. This is just one of the new experiments students will look at. So if I turn this on, you'll start to hear this start to sing. And those of you who get down here will actually see that we've got a node, anti-node, node. The teachers are already seeing the benefits of the training program. It's really good that we've got these two days to just look at it and go through it. Normally in our day-to-day -day teaching life there's not a lot of time so this allows us that opportunity to really have a good look at it. It's challenging because we are rural schools, tend to only have one physics teacher in a school so there's nobody really to talk to or nut out problems with. So that's the beauty of um, today, these two days, is that we can talk to other teachers. The new syllabuses will be implemented in schools for English, Maths, Science and History next year. Kate Fotheringham, Win News.